higher energy. We need protective vibration. And we need to continue to elevate itself so we can be the better version of ourselves and the better version of each individual is the power of the What's good, beautiful people out there in the world? You know, I just hope everybody is doing amazing and continuing to better themselves, you know, in this world and in this time. I just hope you, you know, just finding peace within and just really trying to find more about yourself instead of continuing to be controlled and, um, you know, just at a low vibrational state. Um, today is a very interesting topic. Um, you know, we're going to. You know, we're kind of going to dive into it. For all of you that's new, my name is Tashario Easter. This is Growth Podcast, you know, something I thought in my mind and something that I kind of just put together. And, yeah, this is the beginning of it, but it's going to continue to grow and elevate. And, yeah, it's going to be one of the greatest things I ever created. Um, here, you know, we grow spiritually, mentally, physically, and financially in order to be the better version of self and continue to elevate as ourself. Um, but I have an interesting topic today I want to talk to you guys about, and um, it kind of maybe will motivate you in a way and allow you to get out your comfort zone and allow you to express yourself for who you truly are. Um, and today I basically want to talk about the power of delusion. The power of delusion. Um, you know, I just feel like uh, for most of us humans, you know, on this earth that's super creative and that's super, um, that's super creative and that's like super in tune with ourselves. I feel like, um, you know, it's the power of delusion. And the reason I say that is because some people may look at it like delusion isn't a power. But in fact, it is. Delusion is that thing that you have in your mind that you think is going to come true. It's like manifestation, but we're not going to use the word manifestation. Because a lot of people may think you delusional because you have this idea, but it's not right here in the present moment yet. Like, you have to think about it. Everybody that wasn't a millionaire, that thought they was a millionaire, they was delusional. Because they had it in their mind and they kept saying that they was going to do it. And all of their friends around them was like, you're not a millionaire yet. But their friends was counting in their time. They wasn't counting in our time. Because success don't just come overnight, you know. And it's like, once you got that power of delusion, that power of imagination. And the thing is, what people don't know is, can't nobody see in your mind. Can't nobody even fathom of what you have within you know it's just like it's only you so only you really truly know how your life will turn out and I just feel like us as humans should lean more into the delusion side because it's like the more creative you are the more imagine imaginative I don't even know if that's a word <laughs> the more um the more you imagine your dream coming into fruition, the more power you have to actually manifest it, you know? And it's like, because at the end of the day, if we pause for a second and realize that every single person have a dream and they have a goal. Some people gave up already on their dreams and goals. Some people said, no, I'm going to just sit down at this nine to five and let the government control me. I don't really care anymore. You know, and that's fine. You know, some people are meant for that. Some people are made for that. But I also think every single person on this earth has a purpose. But it's only up to you to tap into that purpose. Some people just don't reach it. Some people will be back here again. Restarting, restarting, restarting. But the people that's really trying to make something happen with themselves, no matter how old they are, no matter how young they are, 
They just have that drive, they have that commitment, and they have that imagination. That delusional state. And the power of delusion is just, it's, it's something that a lot of people don't have. Like, how many times have y'all got made fun of, in front of, in front of, for, like, having this big, big dream and you telling the wrong person? You know? Sometimes you just got to leave everything to yourself because what you may have in your mind may seem insane to who, to whoever else you're telling. You know? Because their mind and their brain isn't wired to be that more expanded. They aren't. They, they got bricks, they they got walls, they can't go too far, they can't go and elevate like your mind can, and I'm, I'm super happy to be a, um, um, such a powerful human being and have a, have a sense of delusion, because it's like, Man, I sit up here every day, and I know I'm going to be a millionaire. I know I'm going to make a big impact on the world. And to have that imagination and to have that thought is so powerful to really sit right here today and say this in a, in a moment, in the present moment of, okay, I'm not there yet, but I will get there. You know? It's like delusion times confident and it's like once you continue to just believe delusion times belief believe if you have an imagination and if you just believe it will connect and your world will come together you will be able to live the life that you deserve be able to live the life that you desire be able to the be able to live the life that you once had in your mind. So I just want, you know, a lot of you guys to just think about that. Don't feel weird. Stop feeling weird that you have this big thought in your mind. You're like, well, this might be a little crazy. No, it's not. That's you creative in your own way. That little thought is what makes you different from the whole entire world. Just that one little thought because nobody else in the world is really thinking what you're thinking. You're just thinking of what everybody else is thinking about you, but in reality, ain't nobody really thinking about you. Those are just thoughts trying to distract you from that great idea that you have within. And that's why I tell everybody to stay tapped into their higher self because your higher self is your best self. And when you be able to project like that out into the world, man, you are you are a powerful human being. You are great. We all have that great desire. We all have great imaginations. All we have to do is delusion times belief. In your life will come into fruition. Quick video, you guys. You know, I just, you know, I just wanted to get on here, you know, speak that because that's something that's been on my mind lately. And, you know, every single thing that's on my mind, I try to let you guys know and um, see if it can help anybody out there in, um, you know, the simple way possible, you know, because we're just always trying to better each other. And it's like, like this what this is what I'm doing now, you know, but I'm also always doing other things. But some people may look at this as boring, but the other people may look at this like, wow, I really needed this, you know? So it's like you can't get hung up on the people that don't like it. You gotta enjoy it for the people that love it. You know? And just focus on the positive. Just continue to elevate. Like I said, man, if you have an idea, tap into that. Yeah. <laughs> the power of the illusion. We're going to continue to elevate. We're going to continue to grow. 
and we're going to continue to be the better version of self, unlock that next level of ourself, 2023, a lot of people say it's your year, execute, if you execute, then you'll really know if it's your year or not, everything that you have on there, execute, I need you to execute, dreams and imagination and that delusional state without execution it's just random thoughts so until you execute you really see the life that you deserve I'm at peace I wish the best for all of you guys out there I wish more and more peace to everybody and their family during these holidays. I just hope everybody continue to elevate. Yeah. I'll see you guys. <laughs>